as many of us know, it's not always smooth sailing down nicely paved roads while you're bicycle touring. So a set of 32 or even 34 millimeter Marathon Plus tyres or Continental Contacts just won't cut it for some situations. So today I've installed a nice set of specialised trigger cyclocross tyres which are predominantly made specifically for gravel conditions and off-road grassy and muddy conditions. The grip is quite pronounced but not too pronounced to slow you down while fully loaded out on the road. As you can see they're quite nice thick tyres, they're very hard on the top and soft on the walls which I'm not quite sure about yet but we'll see what happens as a 38C I don't reckon that you'll get many pinch points along the way if you hit a pothole or a kerb or something by mistake the tread is very nice and grippy around the sides and edges and at the minute they seem to be holding up all right I've been up and down quite a few hills and they seem fine to me off-road when I got this bike it came with a set of continental gator skins these ones and they're very nice 28 millimeter wide they're very good for racing bikes or hybrid bikes if you live in the towns and cities and like to get places fast however with these people have complained to me about pinching on potholes and small curves and that type of thing and that's one of the reasons I got these off-road and specialised trigger tyres is because of the capability to go more off-road along gravel roads and dirt tracks and that sort of thing. I would highly recommend Continental Contacts or Swalby Marathon Plus tyres at 32mm or 34mm like I said before but in this instance for an off-road bike this is going to do my needs perfectly. If you have any questions about what tyres I used or have used in the past on my thousands of miles cycling around the United Kingdom, then please feel free to drop a comment in the comment box below. Till next time, stay safe and I hope you find peace. Although I did actually cycle Land's End John O'Groats on a set of specialised all condition armadillo tyres at 28mm with a fully loaded Trek Alpha 1.2 racing bike and at the time I even had these very same front racks on carbon fibre forks which you highly recommend you never do even though I didn't have any problems